more thing if you're up for it. Once we beat the Dragon Lord, we're gonna be legends! I'm gonna license my face on so many lunchboxes. You can keep your merchandise. I want that Sword of Souls. So you think you guys might stick around after the campaign? I don't know. We really should get to fixing up our ship. Oh. I mean, are you sure? The outside world super sucks right now. You can just stay here and... Play games with me! I live! Welcome back to the land of the... Soon the soul energy will all be mine. You understand what it is, right? Soul energy is wonder itself. Every mountain, every ocean, every pissy little goblin. They're held together by the imagination of a tyrannical tweenager. Well, if it can make entire worlds, it can unmake them. I'm gonna take this madhouse prison, this wonderlands, and I'm gonna free us all from her control. The Wastard said the fear of it is surrounded by a city of the dead. We'll have to find a way in. Oh, don't you look feisty? Two heads are better. Thanks for coming. Oh, I'm not keeping you from something, am I? <laughs> of course not. I'm all you've got. Necessary to emerge triumphant. It is close now. It need only be taken up by heroic hands.
control its walls. The city of Asugal is a carcass. The stones are its bones. The sands are its hands. The nitty gritties are its great big. How we get it? Come on, we're so close. Let's just blast our way in. I mean, I was curious, but yeah, breath right. We should do the blasting uh, thing. As you approach the gate, <sighs> you see a soul well brimming with necromancer's power. The dragon lord is using it to cast a barrier hex over the entire city. Not a problem. Our dispel magic will work on that too. We can kick that evil right out of the well. Taking the credit. Thank the Diamond Queen you came along. Come, my shelter is up here on the wall. So then it looks jump. Beyond mortal ken. And finally! 
Finally, someone who recognizes my brilliance. Yes, I am quite powerful. In fact, I'm on my way to get the Dragon Lord a taste of my boot. Then your path is through the Hall of Heroes. I know it well, though I was too weak to reach it. Come, this way. When I heard of the Queen's death, I journeyed here, hoping the latent soul energy of this city would allow me to bring her back. Perhaps you could succeed where I failed. You cannot escape my game. Illusion magic. The only reason I wasn't picked off my skeleton patrols. You must reach the All of Heroes beyond the inner wall. The Dragon Lord is using the Wells of Sin to keep it blocked off. If you can cleanse the Wells, you'll lift the Exes. Only by cleansing the Wells of Sin. Can you take down the barrier, Hexes, blocking your way? Did you hear what that old guy said? We can bring back Mutt Stallion. I don't know. She met a pretty grisly fate. Ah, uh, but you forget, dear friend. Fate does not divide us. Fate brings us together. How's it gonna bring her head and her body back together? I haven't thought that through yet! Well done.
well with greed. They wanna take your gold. They wanna take your gold! Nicely done. Let's see. If I'm here, then that means... Wait, what does that mean? I think I'm done with these hexes now. I just want to get to the boss. What? No need to rush. We're having fun. Adding out the campaign so that we'll stay here and play bunkers and badasses with you. <laughs> no. Uh, the ancient catacombs <laughs> are an integral part of the narrative. So who's laughing now? Valentine? Hi, it's me. Ha!
not. But I'll take the opportunity. With all this soul energy flowing to me, I can create all sorts of new nightmares. This city was built by a civilization of advanced sorcerers named the Vatu. I've launched an eon of dark campaigns from here, but it was dead long before I arrived. The Vatu understood what soul energy was. They designed the city itself to siphon it out of the world. They used it to rule like arrogant gods at the expense of everyone else. Actually, a pretty good gig if you can get it. I'll skip the rest of the exposition since you know where it's going. The Vatu and their souls were absorbed by the very arcane mechanisms they created. Classic. Just goes to show, no one stays the master forever. <laughs> Somewhere out there. Bother you to know there were fate makers before you. All heroes of their own stories, but they never lived up to their namesake. They just played her game and went through the motions, because that's exactly what she wants.
skeletons are getting restless, especially Grimula. Ugh. I must find the Dark Master. The Dark Master needs me. Blah, blah, blah. I sent him out with a scouting party just to shut him up. Hopefully he trips down a well or something. creations of mine. They exist only to do my bidding. And when they fail, I'll just make a hundred more. Because they're disposable. <laughs> like you. Okay, newbie, to the Hall of Heroes!
enormous arcane device has been erected before the hexed entrance to the Hall of Heroes. It's got a fancy name with a lot of syllables, but basically, it's a giant sweet ass magic laser that you can use to blow open the barrier. This speaks to me. Hey, those guys are hanging out around our giant sweet ass magic laser. Kick their asses. that they say no rest for the wicked you hear a familiar whinny and for a moment you feel hope it's like a dream 
But this is not your queen. It's a nightmare. Sure, blame me. It can never be her that twists good things into monsters. It can never be her fault. Only I know better. Let me show you. Scrolls word prophecies. I wanted to show you what she did to me. What she's doing to you all over again. Okay, Tina. This is your first time playing, right? I mean, yeah. Who would I play with? Everyone else I know is dead. What's it called? Bunkers and badasses. It's a fantasy game. A place where you can be a hero. Where your imagination can change the world. Ooh, I'm the best at imagining, baby. That's perfect. But first, we gotta make a character. Tell me about your Fate Maker. The Fate Maker's tale begins as so many do with a heart full of fire and dreams full of dragons. Magic. He's the coolest, most powerful hero that everyone wants to be friends with. The Dragon Knight. Dragon Knight? Yeah, I like it. Thank you. Well, let's go make some more. Tina, I want to make this an adventure you'll never forget. It feels like something lost long ago has been found again. It feels like home. You reach the inner chamber of the Obsidian Cave Cathedral. 
the sword of souls sits before you. Now, this is a big choice. So... He takes it, and he blows up every bad guy everywhere! Are you sure? Oh yeah, oh yeah, I do it! Boom! I... but... that turns your character evil. What? No, girl, Dragon Knight ain't evil! He's... he's a hero! He's a fight maker! Uh, he just blew up thousands of people? Don't you think that's evil? It's not evil, but this is stupid. I'm not playing this anymore. You know what? I'm gonna be the bunker master, and then I'll make sure only heroes win. Tina, wait. The fate maker is alone. Abandoned for a crime he never chose. He's never chosen anything. To think for himself. No more dice or fate. No more masters. He, I, dream of dragons and magic. I awaken, my heart filled with fire and purpose. Resurrection. I am reborn. The Dragon Lord. There's a choice, Fate Maker. I'd rather find out for myself. Thank you very much. I hoped you could see the truth. I'm not evil. She just writes me this way. Well? Come on, then. If you insist on being a <laughs> hero, there's only one way for this to end. Only one task remains. Ascend the pyramid, defeat the Dragon Lord, and take back the Sword of Souls. Okay, so that's like three, one, tasks. But do it! <laughs>